We carry out a project with FIT in Nigeria. I work with Hemoclear and Hemoclear has developed a autologous blood salvage kit. When you lose blood during a surgery or after or during delivery, that blood is normally collected uh, and is thrown away. With Hemoclear, we can wash the blood to make it safe to give it back to the same person. And Nigeria is the first lower middle income country where we are going to implement this together with FIT and the National Blood Service Commission of Nigeria. The NBSC, which is the National Blood Service Commission, is the agency of government that is then responsible for regulating, coordinating, and then providing safe quality blood for transfusion in Nigeria. Donor blood is life-saving. Uh, it's a very important procedure that's performed often. But donor blood is not always available, which translates to a lot of people suffering or dying unnecessarily. For an example, worldwide, there are still 200,000 women that unnecessarily lose their lives because they start to bleed after delivery and then there's no donor blood. To strengthen the system, uh, in Nigeria specifically, the autologous system that we offer tackles the donor blood shortages and thereby uh, has a huge clinical win for the Nigerian people in general. Our major role is to encourage people to donate blood. The innovation which um, Hemoclair has come up with is um, something that would um, help you know, increase our donor pool and then help increase the number of um, units we get in a year. The innovation or the concept of giving back your own blood is not new. That currently also occurs and has been occurring for a long time and they use complex typical hospital equipment to do that, centrifuges. Hemoclear is different because it uses simple filtration procedure to produce the same high quality blood but uh, it can be used by anyone, it's a disposable kit, and thereby it makes the use of patient own blood much more accessible. Most people are not very comfortable, you know, taking blood donated by other people. So it's a welcome development. The device, you know, coming in, we are trying to adapt to this new technique. And then um, it's also a way of ensuring that autologous blood is processed bedside in the hospitals. FIT really drew us in because of their uh, wealth of experience. Uh, they're young, but still a wealth of experience in uh, tackling poverty and inequality in a very diverse way. They helped uh, in setting the right timing and finding a right timing and providing feedback in a conversation to when perform certain impact evaluation aspects. But also um, because they're very pragmatic, solution oriented, and the communication is very open great feedback. So the project is a first step towards providing autologous blood in lower middle income countries. From the lessons that we learn, we hope to scale up in Nigeria and from there also extend and scale up to other lower middle income countries. And um, of course, go not only for the women in the obstetric setting, but also provide autologous blood to other surgical patients that come into the hospital worldwide. We're very happy with the match and uh, grateful to be working with FIT.